Good morning, everyone. So I just woke up, as you can see <laughs> by what I look like, and it's literally the day before my birthday. So I'm just gonna kind of be filming so you guys can see just like what I'm doing. Kind of want to prep a little bit for like the big day. And I just gotta like run some errands, babysit later on. So yeah, you'll be seeing a lot of interesting things from me. I thought it'd be fun to, you know, film this video. But yeah, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get out of my bed and out of my Hello Kitty pajamas, which I mean, these are cute though, but we still gotta get all done and get ourselves ready. And then I gotta go and make my princess bed because it is currently still unmade. So yeah, that is what I'm gonna be doing now. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and make the princess bed because obviously it doesn't look as cute when it's all like messed up like this. So you guys, I guess we'll see my process of how I make this. So as you can currently see, my bed is made. So this is what it looks like. And as you can see, I have an obscene amount of stuffed animals also on my bed. Like this just makes the process longer, but honestly, it just motivates me to make my bed every day because I get to see all of these cute guys on my bed. And yeah, so now I have to go and get myself dressed because I need to head to the post office to just drop off some Depop packages of mine and I'll see you guys once I am finally dressed. So as you can see, my makeup is done and I'm ready to go out. But before I do, I'm gonna go and show you guys my outfit of the day. So here is the outfit of the day. And so I kind of wanted to go for a very comfy and casual look, but also still wanted to be signature to me. So I still wanted to be very girly. So to break down what I'm wearing for my hair, I just have it up in a ponytail and I have it held up with this little white ruffly scrunchie right here. And then I have some really cute dangle charm earrings on my ears. Super cute because like, look, it's a little pig. <laughs> so adorable. And then I have this little pink glossier hoodie on. It's very comfy and very warm so that's why I chose it today because the weather is quite a bit cooler than it has been. Then I have this white lace skirt on, super cute and pretty. And then for my shoes I have some white ruffle socks on and then I have my pink Rihanna Puma sneakers and I love these because um, first of all they're satin and then they also have a little bow on them which is perfect in my opinion. But yeah, so we're gonna go into the car now and I'm gonna go and run some errands. I almost forgot to show my purse today. This is the one I'm wearing, the super cute white cream colored one with a little bow on it. And yeah, I think now we're officially ready to go. So let's go in the car. So I'm accompanied here with my sister, Caddy. Hello. She's joining us today. And so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna drop off these packages at the post office so people who order from me can finally receive their orders. We're about to go inside CVS. Ooh, Barbie fan guide, even though I still haven't watched this movie, but I do want to watch it. Of course you go right for the pig. <laughs> you know me. And I also have this little hearts and a little bow on it. <laughs> Look at how cute this little face mask is. It's adorable. Loki thinking about getting this because it says strawberry on it. And it looks like a light pink, like yeah. the type that you like, so. I think I would use it. Yeah. I love things from Claire's and I have this exact scent right here, but it's in like the form of an actual like body mist and it smells so good. The notebooks in here are always so freaking cute too. I've literally been looking for these forever. They're always out of stock. I have to see which one I actually want to get. <laughs> These are so freaking cute as well. They have the little BT21 guys on it. I totally forgot about these guys until now. This is like a late 2000s nostalgia moment. They were everywhere. They were. I remember going to like Hallmark with my grandma and seeing these guys like everywhere. <laughs> mm -hmm. So I did wind up getting a few things there. Did not end up getting the Hello Kitty lip oil because apparently that was broken. Um, yeah, that so was... I didn't want to spend 12 freaking dollars yeah. for something broken. So I just put that one back. Mm -hmm. And yeah, so now we're gonna just go to Dollar Tree and maybe some other places and we'll see you soon. Currently heading into Dollar Tree. These are actually really cute. I'm considering maybe getting these. 
Why would she do this to me? Are you lost, baby girl? Get away from me. <laughs> These pens are so mean girls coded. Are they serious right now? Dollar Tree Plus? I am not spending more than $1.25 at this damn place. <laughs> These ones are cute. I particularly like the little strawberry one. I just found Buster. Oh my god, I hate this bitch. He was so gross. No, I'm like obnoxious and rude. so like, right. I mean, to be honest, there was worse characters on Arthur, but like, Buster gave me the egg. I'm sorry. I hated him, and then is this, her name's like Francie or something. Yes. Oh I hated gosh, her. She was obnoxious. I hated her. DW was the best character. Obviously, she, she has was, a like, W in her, her name. Funny, to be honest, <laughs> like. I found some ribbon and I think I'm gonna get it because it's like this really cute blue satin one and I could use it for like my hair and little crafts and stuff. These would be actually really cute for like decora. This is so cute. Look at the little strawberries and even more strawberry themed items. Juicy smoochies. I mean, I kind of like the name of this. I'm not sure if it actually would work well. Bruh, not me finding dupe Takis at the Dollar Tree. I'm actually wondering if they're any good. For anyone who doesn't know, I'm actually obsessed with craisins. These are like some of my favorite healthier snacks to eat. Hey, Kenny. What the hell are you doing? You're an orange now. <laughs> got some cute things i'll show you guys later once i go back home but now we're basically gonna just head over to walmart and then i think it's pretty much it i don't think we have to really go anywhere else today okay we're currently heading into walmart look at how cute these ones are and the other one it's like in gray and it has little like star stars on them oh that's cute like for real these are cute as well i don't yeah, know if you I like, like them ones. but this is probably one that I would actually get personally. Yeah, I love myself some stuffy. <laughs> that wasn't obvious enough. Yeah, it wasn't obvious enough. <laughs> Wait, tell me why this is actually so Ariana Grande 2014 vibes. Cause if you wanna kill me, you're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> they kind of ate though. They're actually kind of cute. Yeah. This is all so cute. Oh my god, I love Claire's. These are so cute too. Oh my god, I'm considering getting these. Oh my god. Do they have any more size room? This is large. Damn. No. I guess got the galaxy print. I guess galaxy print is coming back into style. <laughs> no, no, keep it away. It's kind of cute sometimes. I don't know. I'm kind of weird with that. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I can hear you out on this one. I'm sorry. Why are these actually so seen? Like, do you get my vision? You? Like the neon pink, the leopard, and it's like also sparkly in the back. These are so seen to me. <laughs> they got three friends up here, bro. Loki's so fine. Why do I kind of want them in a way? I feel like these would be like really comfortable. <laughs> They got the off-brand Stray Kids comp. I know. So, I mean, I guess if you're a stay and you want something that's cheaper, come um, to Walmart. Yeah. <laughs> Are you filming? I am, yeah. Oh, my God. That's is that a skirt? So I think it is a skirt. Like... Girl, your that's reaction was cute. so funny. I'm so happy I had that on camera. Be, I think this might be like a matching... Walmart's gonna steal all your money today, isn't it? I'm gonna have to try this on now. <laughs> I mean, I don't find Hello Kitty. Let me see the sweater. Look at this. Oh my god, that is, that is really cute, actually, though. I would totally wear this because it's also kind of like lightweight, you know? Mm hmm. Are you filming again? I am, yes. Yeah, oh, okay, that one actually is super cute. This is like an emo sweater. These are my two personalities, man. That's true. <laughs> That's true. Hello Kitty. <gasps> Holy shit! Oh my god, Walmart's popping today! <laughs> <laughs> the emos need to run to Walmart right now. Exactly. Is this is Walmart? so emo, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I'm trying to see. But I would try on. Maybe I try on like a 10 to 12 so it fits me a little tighter. Yeah. I'm literally going crazy in here today though. Jama's here too. Jeez, they got everything here. These are so freaking cute. I need to get you out of the store before you spend all your money. Hi Barbie. Hi Ken. Cosmetics. Yes. Hello. 
how many different spooky colors and themes they got going on here this year. All very cute. Oh, these are, those are pretty. I like all the glittery ones, of course. They have Casper. Look. Oh. They have like, three different. This one's kind of like a cool holographic iridescent color. Mm -hmm. This is like more of like a white, but yeah, like a it looks damaged color. to yeah, me. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Because yeah. that one looks like it'd be like a super blinding I highlighter. Know. I don't know. Maybe I can think about it depending on price. Yeah. I'm not sure how much it is. $4.98. Oh. That's actually not too so bad. Okay. I might, I might consider it then. Yeah. Let's see. These are so cute. I just like like the packaging itself. Like, yeah. I love anything that's like old vintage cartoons, especially if it's like with ghosts. Yes, because like you love a little spooky. I love a little spookiness. So I'm just looking at all of this right now. What is that? Duo chrome liner. Oh. What is this? This is cool. Is this supposed to be an eyeliner? I what think so. This? Okay. I'm interested. I'm interested. Look at these. That's sick. I feel like the camera isn't even doing it justice. No, nah, these are really cool though. I want to see if this is like maybe the shade that I have. Yeah. That's the white <gasps> one. But it's not broken. <gasps> oh my yes. god. Slay, slay, slay. Okay, I need to get this because I really want to try that out. It looks blinding. For real. Blinding. <gasps> they have a little Casper bag too. That's so cute. That is so freaking cute. And it says includes face and body gems. That's adorable. Yeah. I wonder what this would look like on because I have a few of the other colors. And they're not very pigmented, right? No. So I'm like, would this actually be dark or would it just give like a slight sheer darkness to it? Yeah, I don't know. What shade even is that? Um, it's a uh, acai, acai later. later. <laughs> it's not really a clever pun. No. And that's like, it's not. yeah, girl. Is that like glittery? What is Let's that? Let's get physical. No, it's just like a really light pink. Um, so basically a clear gloss. I feel like these two would be like the exact same color because I have this one. Yeah. And it's like really sheer pink. Mm -hmm. like you rarely see the color, so. This one works honestly just better as like a clear gloss so if you have like a fairer to medium complexion because it doesn't really give that much color, I'm telling you. She's really cute. Her outfit. Yeah. She's got like I little like leg one. warmers on, and everything. And then this one's very like groovy 70s mm -hmm. vibe. <gasps> this one's so cute. That's what I would wear. <laughs> the like LOL dolls are actually really cool. Like, yeah, they're super cute. Yeah. What are these? The Rainbow Visions? Um, yeah, I think those are, I like the way they're dressed, but like, I feel like their eyes are too far apart for me. Yeah, they look a little like uncanny know. valley. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe that's what it they look is. like a robot or something that's trying to be human. Her outfit's cute. Like, just, I don't like her face though. The face is, it's maybe the heads are too big. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah. They need to, both. They need to redo that. Cause like their outfits are adorable. Oh my god, is that a creeper onesie? Yeah, it is. <laughs> more creeper drip. <laughs> yeah, more creeper drip. Okay, I'm about to try some clothes on now. This is actually pretty cute, so I might consider buying this. This is kind of like an emo version of an ugly Christmas sweater. <laughs> Hmm, maybe? I don't know how I feel about orange on me. I think my arms are like slightly too long for this one. <laughs> this one's actually pretty cute. It's very emo. You know. Okay, so I'm kind of like, eh, about everything. I was thinking about maybe this, but it's like close to 20 bucks. Oh. So I'm like not entirely sure if I love it that much that I'm gonna get it, so. I'm just gonna put these back. Mm-hmm. Sadly. <laughs> Why are these kind of popping though? They're kind of party rockers in the house tonight. Exactly, they're so like seeing kid vibes. <laughs> Okay, so we just got out of Walmart and I didn't end up getting any of the clothing, but I did end up getting like a few cute things. So I will show you everything that I got when I go back home. Hello, so we're currently back home and we just wanted to show you what we got from Walmart, Dollar Tree, and, and CVS. CVS. Yeah. yeah, so we're gonna go and show you everything right now. Okay, so Kylie's gonna go first. She's gonna show you guys everything that she got. I only got this from CVS, like, the NYX Butter Gloss in yeah. the shade Ginger Snap. I actually have a bit of it on right now. It's pretty. Yeah, it is. I was a little scared because I was like, mm, it's a little darker than what I usually use, but it isn't too like bad. 
Yeah. So it's not too pigmented? Yeah. It's but it's pigmented of... enough. Oh, okay. So maybe you could like layer I it also, if you didn't yeah. want to. I also have it shade. layered over a gloss right now. So maybe that's why it wasn't as pigmented. Oh, maybe. it's like fighting yeah. the formulas. Yeah, exactly. Now Dollar Tree. <laughs> that was where I spent most of my money. Dollar Tree's amazing. These hot shoes which mom, if you're watching this, which I know you are. <laughs> Moderation, okay. In moderation, we can have our hot chips. Exactly, this is the lime one. Yeah, these are hard to find. And if you've never tried these, go you need to and right try now. to find them. And then I got this because I think it's just like good to have a little makeup pouch. Yeah, you could like use it to separate like lip glosses. That's and stuff what I was like that. thinking. Because that's what I'm doing with like three other pouches just for like lip products. So <laughs> yeah, I think we'll use that a lot. And then this is like a concealer thing. And I was thinking for Halloween, I could use it to like make my face look pale. I might be going as a zombie rat thing again this year. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, I've been thinking. Yeah, you're just thinking. Um, and then I have this, which I already used. It's like a little like clumping lip gloss, gloss. But I got the same yeah. thing, so I'll show you what it looks like also. And it actually is pretty good. You just, the applicator is like a little small. So you have to use a good portion of it. My last Dollar Tree purchase is these. Which again, don't mom, worse. don't yell at me, please. Yeah, she just wants some candy. Exactly, exactly. It's not that much. Gummy worms slap so hard though. And then from Walmart, which I also have a bit of this on right now, but I'm a it's little scared that I'm having an allergic reaction. So I'm gonna wear it with like not anything else. I have yeah, like all three see. of the lip products that I bought, I have on right now. Uh huh. What's the shade of this one? Uh, Acai You Later. Oh yeah, that's the stupid shade. Yeah. I don't like that name, Acai. It's like too much to say. Exactly, like, combined with See You. Acai you later. It's just too much to say. Acai Maybe. is cute, but I don't like the way they did that as a pun. Exactly. Nah. Come on now. The applicator on this. Oh, that's big. It's I really, really like thick. the shape of it. Yeah. But like it, along with the other yummy glosses, it's not really that pigmented. No, you it's good as like, yeah. like a very sheer, very like, if you want to go for something that's already this color and then just yeah. put it over it, it's like a good gloss for that. But if you want it for like actual color, ah. All right, so my turn. So again, like Heidi was saying, she got me these Cheetos. <laughs> it's like an early little birthday gift. Yeah, so thank you. Of course, of course. I'm so excited to eat these. It's been like, I can't remember. It's been maybe even a year since I've had these. They're just really hard to find, honestly. Mm -hmm. So I was surprised when we saw these at the Dollar Tree. And then speaking of Dollar Tree, this is also the same lip gloss that Caddy got, so I got this, and yeah. I'm really excited to try it out because it says it's infused with almond oil, hoba seed oil. Hmm. Interesting, and it says it's a plumping lip gloss. So. It feels nice, yeah. I have to say. So I'm really excited to try this out. Hopefully it looks like nice on me. And then I also wound up getting these LA Color, LA Colors, Glow in the Dark Stiletto Shape Artificial Nail Tips. Like these ones for you right, now. right here, yeah, because I broke my freaking nail at Walmart. Um, but these ones are really cute. They have like little sparkles on them. I don't know if you can see it on camera, but they're Probably so do. freaking cute. Yeah, and they're just like a cute little baby pink natural shade. So really excited to try these on. And then, um, oh yeah, so I found also this at Dollar Tree. At our Dollar Trees, at least, you'll find like actual like name That's brand like a products. Thing, yeah. yeah, so I guess it's like everywhere it's like mm -hmm. this. So I found this L'Oreal Paris little liquid lip, I think. I think that's what it is. The shade is 450. I have no idea what this is gonna look like on me, but if it doesn't look good, I'll probably just give it to Caddy or maybe Yay. my mom. So <laughs> yeah. The formula on those are they're really nice. I hope so. Because I I'm really excited one. to try it out. And then I also got some blue satin ribbon because this would be perfect for like little coquette moments and all of that. And then um, let's see. So from CVS, I got basically just two things. I got this butter gloss right here in the shade Meringue. And so this is a very like kind of purpley pink color. So I'm curious of what this is gonna actually look like on me. And then I wound up getting this Burt's Bees Lip Shimmer in the strawberry shade because obviously I'm a big strawberry fan, like. And that's like, I that's literally it. your shade of pink. Yeah, like, it is, honestly. Hello. It's like very like cold pink, which is like my favorite. It was made for you. Exactly. And let's see. So from Walmart is probably where I got like the most stuff from. So I wound up getting these little Claire's earrings right here. 
I think they're so adorable. I mean, when I saw them, I was like, I can't get them. Literally, they're heart-shaped little pearls. Dying. Again, this would be perfect for like more like pretty casual outfits or for more like coquette type of looks because they're perfect for that. And then let's see. So I got three different mascaras here. One is the L'Oreal Voluminous Lash Paradise Mascara. They came with a two pack, so I have two now. And then I also got the Voluminous Original by L'Oreal. And then I got the Maybelline New York Full and Soft Thick and Healthy Mascara. This is what this looks like. And so I'm gonna be using these for like a future video that I have planned. So you guys should stay tuned for that. I'll basically be comparing. I'll get that. Just drop that blooper. But so I'll be comparing these to the Better Than Sex mascara and I'll see if these are good dupes to that. And then you saw me go gaga over these. <laughs> I got two Casper highlighters and then one Casper eyeliner thingy. Yeah. Oh yeah, I think it's an eyeliner. So this is what this one looks like and it's in the shade Cena Ghost. I think it's really cool. I'm really curious on how that will look. Yeah, I'm really curious because I'm like, yo, a shimmery, shiny eyeliner? Mm -hmm. Like, is it a liquid eyeliner? Is it one that you're like supposed to put under your eyes? Like a crayon type look of one? Look at the like the type of brush. Does it have a brush? I didn't see one, so I was confused. Um, hopefully it, it's good. <laughs> yeah, I'm and then perplexed. Yeah, and then I got two different little highlighters right here. This one called Fabulous, and it's like a really white color. You can't really see the colors too well because it's kind of like reflecting because I have a window in front of me. <laughs> and then this one is like super bluey, holographic, um, iridescent type of vibes. So this one is called Ghosting You. But I'm really excited to try out these two colors because they weren't even that much. I think they're like four bucks each. So. And they have Casper on them, which is like adorable. Hey. So cute. So yeah, that is everything that we got. Um, hope you guys enjoyed watching that. Kisses for now. Caddy's being generous. There you go, queen. Yay! Happy birthday. I got the little pink one. Yay. Okay, so me and Caddy have to walk our dog. So I was like, hey, what if we do like a little adventure for the vlog and we take her a little bit longer than we usually do. Yeah. And you guys get to see it too. So Yay! yeah, I was thinking I will show you guys that while we're walking. Okay, we're currently walking with our dog, so. Look, I have a little friend on me. Oh, he's Means it's good away. luck. <laughs> okay, so I just got home from walking my little beautiful girl. Say hi to me. Say hi to the camera. <laughs> She's not looking. So I am going to be picking out an outfit that I want to wear for my birthday. You love those head scratchies, don't you? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I recently bought a dress too, which would be perfect for tomorrow. It's by this brand called Jesus Diamante, which is this older Hime Gyaru brand that you can't really find very well anymore. Like usually the dresses retail for $200, but I got this one for $45 freaking dollars and... Oh my god, I have to show you what it looks like. It's so freaking cute. Literally the most Rococo vibes I've ever seen. So this is the dress that I was talking about. I mean, look at the vibes. So Rococo. Looks like something that maybe Marie Antoinette would wear, honestly. It's so gorgeous, so lacy, and of course has this beautiful bow in the front of it. And I just can't wait to wear this tomorrow. Like, I feel like I'm gonna look like a pretty princess and that's what I want to achieve. So yeah, I basically have to figure out what I'm gonna be styling her with because obviously she's a very special piece. We gotta style her right, do her good. So the shoes I'm thinking of matching with this are these ones right here. These gorgeous little heels that I got off of AliExpress. And these are actually Lolita shoes, but I use them for like literally any type of fashion so j fashion just girly fashion whatever and i just feel like they work perfectly because they're very roughly have bows on them and they just give off a very pretty rococo vibe and these are the socks right here that i'll probably use with the dress i think they're so cute because i mean look at the little pearl details and then of course the dainty little bow so i'm hoping these work out well with tomorrow's outfit i'm gonna add some pearl bracelets too because i feel like it adds on to the really rococo a luxury type of vibe i was also thinking of maybe pairing these two necklaces right here 
with these heart-shaped pearl dangle earrings. I think they would look pretty cute together, but we'll see tomorrow what I actually end up doing. And for my hair, I'm thinking of using this pinky peach bow headband right here because it's literally the exact same color as the dress. And I'm thinking of using this bag right here because it's ruffly, it's lacy, it has the pearls all over it, and I really think it would match very well with the outfit. So yeah, now that my outfit is done and out of the way, I have to go ahead and babysit for someone in my neighborhood. So I will see you guys later. Hello, so I am currently back home from babysitting and I am currently in my fanciest nightgown, you know, to celebrate before the big day. <laughs> I feel like I look very like 1960s-esque right now with like my hair, this nightgown. Very cute, curly, and flouncy. But yeah, before I go to bed, I kind of thought it'd be fun if I showed you my skincare routine. And this is kind of like a special skincare routine because I'm using like my most expensive products that I only use for like special occasions at the moment. So yeah, I thought it'd be fun for you guys to see that. So that's what we'll be doing. And yeah, so a way of the crusty makeup, hello, glowing, beautiful skin. <laughs> so first thing we gotta do is we gotta put the hair back. I don't know how smooth of a transition that was, but if it's smooth, I'm really proud of myself. <laughs> I am wearing this My Melody headband and it is my favorite to use. It really holds back all my bangs and framing pieces and I just freaking love it. And it was also like three bucks off AliExpress, so how can you get any better than that? But yeah, enough of me blabbing. Let's go into the skincare. Let's get these sleeves up because don't want these to get damaged. First thing I'm doing is I'm going into this Neutrogena Melting Balm stuff because I want to get rid of all the makeup on my face. And now that I've oiled my face up, I'm going to go in with this Cetaphil cleanser right here. It's good for like removing all the dirt, oil, and makeup. I already feel very refreshed. And next thing I'm gonna do is go in with this Effaclar Duo Acne Cream right here and then just kinda put this on any spots that need correcting. And now I'm gonna use this Glow Recipe Toner right here. I love this stuff because it smells like watermelon and it's just really refreshing on the skin. And now I'm gonna go put on some of this Pixi Glow Tonic Serum right here. This stuff really does make you look very glowy afterwards. It's like a glazed donut. <laughs> and then the last step is to moisturize. So I'm gonna use this Glow Recipe Moisturizer right here. nice and glowy my skin looks ah so dewy and fresh i'm just gonna brush my hair real quick because i like to do that before i go to sleep and yeah now i'm all ready for bed i'm all clean and glowy all right i'm like super tired so i'm gonna actually go and fall asleep now good night Good morning, everyone. It's currently my birthday. Oh, I can't believe today's the day. It feels so weird. <laughs> so I'm about to get up and I get myself ready because me and my mom are going to go to the tea room soon, which I'm super excited about. And yeah, I'll show you guys once I'm actually, you know, starting to get myself dressed. But before we get going, I just wanted to say my skin looks really glowy and healthy looking. I think I need to start including that Pixi Glow Tonic Serum thing into like my regular routine because wow. I've never had my skin glowing like this and I was literally staying up last night watching Johnny Gilbert with my sister and also eating Cheetos. You can see on my fingers, caught me red-handed. <laughs> so the fact that my skin actually looks like this is insane. So I feel like I'm definitely gonna start using that in like my actual beauty routine too. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get myself ready. 
Hello everyone, so I'm about to go and as you can see I am all ready now So I have my pinky peachy slash golden makeup on and then of course I have my beautiful princess dress on Which I'm about to show you guys in a second. So here is the outfit of the day birthday edition <laughs> So for my head I have on this beautiful peachy pink satin bow and then I also have these really pretty pearly heart dangle earrings that I showed you guys yesterday. And then for my necklaces, I kind of want to look different. I kept this one, but then I instead changed the gold one for this beautiful pearl one right here. And then of course I have on my beautiful Jesus Diamante dress, which is so pretty with a petticoat on. And then I have my adorable little pearly ruffly bag that I purchased from Taobao. Then instead of the ruffle socks, I went with these white ballerina type of tights because I honestly thought it looked more Rococo anyway and it just kind of looks better with the outfit in general. And then for my shoes, I have these beautiful peachy pink bow ruffle lolita heels on which i love and adore but yeah so that is the whole outfit we're gonna go out to eat now and i'll see you guys soon my mom's currently getting gas and my mom found me a quarter <laughs> so it's my lucky day check with my mom <laughs> for a drink i think i'm going to get this one because i'm not really into sparkling drinks so lemonade sounds the best to me right now okay i think i'm gonna get this option right here it seems really yummy and it's calling to me look at this fancy book i'm reading and guess what it says it's from 1863, which I think is crazy. I got my most favorite lemonade right here. It's always so pretty. And my mom is getting some tea, so she has some little like sugar cubes included as well. Time to test. Delicious as always. Two thumbs up for me. Yeah, I'm very scrumpy. <laughs> <laughs> so here is my meal. And then this is what my mom is eating. Everything looks really yummy. I can't wait to eat this. We got some little tea cakes and look at how cute they are. Oh my god, I can't wait to try these out. Hello everyone, so I'm currently back home and me and my mom literally had the best time at that tea room. We ate like literal freaking queens. So now that I'm back home, I think I'm gonna go and change out of these clothes. But yeah, so I'm just thinking maybe watching like some TV, reading a bit, and then of course having like a little pamper myself type of day. Currently just chilling in my jammies. Tui's also chilling on my bed. <laughs> I literally just spent like 30 to 40 minutes just cleaning up my room because I don't know about you guys, anytime I get myself ready, oh boy, my room looks like a war zone. <laughs> so I just kind of cleaned up everything. I just do have some like clothing here on the bed. But more or less, as you can see, my room is pretty clean now. Hello everybody, so I'm kind of ending this a little abruptly, but I didn't really get very much footage after I changed into my pajamas, so um, yeah, I'm kind of ending this vlog right here just because I really was just talking to my family a lot because I mean it is my birthday, so you know, I wanted to spend some time with my family and yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed watching what I did film for you guys. Hope you guys are healthy, safe, and doing well. And before I go, let me send you off with heart, heart, and heart to you. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Ta-ta!